Today's Flash Briefing is brought to you by Power Credit Union, proudly serving Southern Colorado. Visit a location today and be empowered. Good Thursday morning. I'm Bree Groves with your News 5 update. And here's what you need to know today. The state health department reporting 315 new cases of coronavirus in Colorado on Wednesday. The number of people hospitalized hasn't changed, so it's all going downward. However, sadly, five more Coloradoans did die from COVID-19. Governor Jared Polis planning to extend that statewide mask mandate set to expire this Sunday on the 16th. The governor says the data shows wearing masks has contributed to our great success in reducing the spread of the virus and in turn that helps our community to continue to move forward. Watching out for you if you have used up all of your regular unemployment benefits benefits from the state. The Colorado Labor Department saying some people may be eligible for emergency unemployment compensation, which would extend those benefits for up to 13 weeks. And if you want to apply or just learn more about it, head on over to the state's website. Now to your forecast with meteorologist Sam Schreier. So we are talking about heat today. Temperatures into the 90s, if not Triple digits, 96 degrees in Colorado Springs, 101 Pueblo. Yes, more of that heat out towards La Hunta Lamar. And then some 80s, but smoke possible in kind of the northern front range and then up towards Denver. In the seven day forecast, heat, heat remains the main thing we're talking about. We will have spotty to scattered storm chances there from Sunday through Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. And then yes, a lot of warmth today and tomorrow. Touch cooler Saturday, but we felt it's dry. And just kind of touching again on those rain chances, the storms don't look overly powerful themselves, but we just think the chances on general are on, you know, overall are kind of light. Hotter Pueblo through that seven day stretch, dry the next three days, storm chances there, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Thank you for listening to today's News 5 Flash Briefing, sponsored by Power Credit Union.